This is Mike from 3D Outfitters, and you are looking at a new version of our dual channel temperature and air quality meter, which is specifically designed for 3D printer enclosures. So you can see on the inside, we've had a pretty big rise down from zero up to a couple of hundred parts per billion. And at the same time, you saw a nice rise in temperatures because this is an ABS print, so we want it pretty hot. And you can see that it's pretty hot outside the enclosure too, and that's because I didn't want indoor air quality to mess with the reading, so I'm actually out in my garage, garage in North Carolina. So the values that you see here can also be viewed inside Octoprint. So if you're an Octoprint fan, you can connect this and watch the air quality values and the temperature values change alongside with your heat bed and the hot end. The, what you can see here is that the, I just stopped the print and so it's sort of, the uh, VOCs are sort of going down a little because I've got a fan on back. So what happens when you print is with ABS, I turn the fan off so it gets hot, but then all of the VOCs are captured inside the enclosure. So you're getting some lung protection there, but you can't just open the door then because then all the VOCs would come out. So I go over here and turn on the filter and that will, in a few minutes evacuate everything. Now the cool part is outside that you can see that in my workspace, there are hardly any VOC. So lungs are clear, everything's safe. And uh, it's amazing how just putting a box over something gives you this much protection. And you can see it's going down now, the print's not working and the fan's going. So it'll be evacuated in a couple minutes. Uh, so this is the version we're shipping now, but we are currently working on a version that adds fan control to this, and that'll probably be the last feature for this product. That's probably going to take all summer because we've got to do a new circuit board for this, so, and that has to be put into production. But right now, this is plenty useful just doing two channel temperatures inside and out, or you could do two channels inside if you wanted, and VOC meter. So I hope you guys find it useful.